And if you're out driving today, you may be shocked when you pass by gas stations and see the prices. Many stations have jumped from $3.78 to $3.99 a gallon. News 10's Abby Walton joins us now live from our studio to tell us just how people are reacting to this large increase. And my guess, Abby, they're not happy. And you would be correct, Susie. They are not happy about this increase. Right now, a gallon of regular unleaded gas is starting to get closer to its all-time national high of $4.11 a gallon, which was set back in 2008. That increase means you may start to see prepay pump signs popping up again at gas stations around the area. Just this morning, the 500 Express on Ohio Street here in Terre Haute put up prepay signs because other stores have dealt with pump and runs already. For customers like Don Riley, he says rising gas prices could mean less money for his detailing business in Terre Haute. We go and pick up vehicles and um, all of that is expense that I have to absorb because right now our prices are pretty fixed. So uh, every time the gas goes up, that hurts my bottom line. Meanwhile, rising gas prices are also starting to take a hit at your local grocery store. Products you could start to see an increase on are deli ham, flour, orange juice, and shredded cheddar cheese. But so far, we haven't seen food prices hit their all time high, which again was set back in 2008. Susie, back to you. Thank you so much, Abby. And if you would like to see the latest on gas prices, we encourage you to head on over to WTHITV.com and click on the pump watch section.